Welcome back to our logbook checker tutorials. In this tutorial we'll look at how to add log sheets, what some of the fields are available to you, how to edit them and a few other features of the log sheets area of the logbook checker app. To add a log sheet you simply tap on the plus at the top there. It'll come up with a date, which is normally the next date in order after the log sheet that you've just entered. You notice the security number, that's the black alphanumeric text at the top of your driver work diary. Simply put that in here. Underneath that is page number, that's normally in red on your driver work diary, and that increments by one as you go through your work diary. So put, you type that number in here. Accreditation number, that's your BFM accreditation number. Um, if you'd put that in before, that would appear here. Now, you notice there's a number of switches. The first one is standard hours. If you're running on standard hours, you choose to turn that to on. If, on the other hand, you're running with BFM, turn BFM to on. The other option for Eastern State drivers is standard bus, which is down the bottom here, which is for bus drivers, a special fatigue option for them. You either have, you've also got with standard hours and BFM, you've got two up, another switch, which if you turn on, you'll notice that some more information appears at the bottom of the screen. So we can actually scroll that up where you can type in your co-driver name, license number, the security number for their driver work diary page and the page number for it. Notice here you have a list button. If you tap on that, it will bring up a list of all the drivers that you've entered in Logbook Checker, the Logbook Checker app. If you want to know how to add drivers and to edit your main driver information, have a look at the tutorial on drivers and vehicles. If I tap on one of the drivers, it will bring in his license number, license state and name. If you type in the security number for his driver work diary and the page number, what Logbook Jekka does is actually increment this by one each time you add a new log sheet. So it does that automatically for you. We'll scroll back up. Get rid of the keyboard. If you're a WA driver, you'll notice there's WA rules. That's for your fatigue options. And if you turn that on, you then get a an option where you can choose which hour rule you want to use at this for um, your log entries. So those that are explained there, they're part of the WA legislation. And if you sorry, choose option A, hit done, that's for two up. We turn two up off, it gives you two options again for solo driving. So all the options for um, WA rules are in there as well. We'll go back to um, and put this on standard hours. Notice how it turns out for WA rules and we'll leave it as two up. Notice the driver information is still there and hit save. So that's how you add a log sheet in Logbook Checker, as simple as that. You can edit any log sheet by tapping on that blue disclosure button on the right and change any of the information that's in there. We won't change anything at this stage. Also standard gestures apply, such as swipe to delete or hitting edit on the top and tapping on one of these red buttons down the side, you can delete an individual entry. Hit done to get out of the edit mode and you're back to normal. You'll notice also on the top, there's a total information. So this is saying so far in September, you've worked or driven 11 hours and 30 minutes and you've had no nights away. I didn't point that out before, but if we go and modify this 
this log sheet, you'll notice there's nights away that can allow you to keep track of your nights away for each month. You just turn that switch to on. Fit for duty is, um, it will put that on your driver work diary sheet so when you email it in that your office will know that you've ticked fit for duty for those who are doing that sort of information for the office. Hit save and you'll notice here now that nights away is incremented by one. So that's basically it for adding log sheets, editing log sheets and, and viewing log sheets. Thanks.